Well, tell me what else is going on. Is there anything else we need to tell everybody? I, I, I want to go ahead. I'm excited about this. You also asked me to uh, would I do something for you in August of 2021, and I, uh, I man, I am I'm I'm looking forward to it. I'm honored that you would ask me to uh, to do this. And uh, can you tell everybody about? It? Let's go ahead and make the announcement. Well, I'm honored that you would accept. Well, oh yeah, it was a no-brainer for me. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, the the. The Royal Songwriting Contest Committee for the 2021 Solani Riverkeeper Songwriting Contest requested that Steve Nichols here, the famous radio host. I don't know about famous now. I am a radio host, though. I'll give you that. Well, it says right on the website, <laughs> the most uh, listened talk show in, in the area. Uh, There's a fact there. That okay, so coming up eight, at uh, 7 p.m. on um, August uh, 22nd, uh, excuse me, August 21st, 2021, that's a Saturday, mm -hmm. uh, currently scheduled for 7 to 10 p.m. at the Art Park, the Turner Center Art Park, 605 North Patterson Street, Valdosta, Georgia, is the fourth annual Swanee Rift Keeper Songwriting Contest. Man, that's awesome right there. I can't wait. You know, I got a long mm -hmm. musical background. Oh, there you go. Yeah, Tell us why. I can do a lot of good singing. Now, oh. half, half, my, half my audience disagrees with that. But, you know, that's all right. But no, I love music and I'm honored to do that. I think I've always had just a, a, a reverence for talent and uh, someone that can actually put pen to paper and write songs is just, man, that's just a gift that I, that I, that I envy. And, I, and I'm just looking forward to that night. It's also for a great cause. And, uh, mm -hmm. and uh, I, I'm honored that you guys asked me. I mean that and I appreciate that. Looking forward to it. Well, good, and you know, we will have some headliners play. Uh, last year we had one. We're thinking of expanding it. This idea comes from our committee, which now has four songwriters on it. Wow. Three of them local to Valdosta. You yeah. may have heard of David Roddick. Uh, Absolutely. Yep, yep. Yeah. He plays by himself and with Dirty Bird and the Flu, and Angela and Josh Duncan, they're on there. And we got uh, Laura Dallasera from Jacksonville, who was our first year winner. She liked it so much, she's still on the committee. <laughs> Good stuff. And then we'll have half a dozen finalists play, oh, in between the judges. We'll have three judges. They will play a song each. That's cool. So it's going to be a, at least a mini festival, and once the finalists play, the judges will decide which ones win which prizes. Oh, that's awesome, right? And then it being at the Turner uh, Park, that's going to be a great setting. That's a great mm -hmm. little, that's a gem in our community. I know you agree with that. And uh, the Turner Center has done a good job. Samantha mm -hmm. Matthews. And that gang is just a, it's just a wonderful facility. So oh, yeah. it's going to be a good night. But, yeah, they bailed us out uh, this year because you know, oh, we're yeah. going, how can we do this in the pandemic? Right. There's plenty of room out there for staying apart. And you know we'll have masks oh, yeah. in case yeah. you don't bring yours. It's in Valdosta. Remember, you're supposed yeah. to be Well, hopefully masks. by then, uh, you know, we'll, we'll be in a better position, I hope. But, uh, I hope so, yeah. but you know we we got a plan for contingencies. That's exactly. Got to be prepared. That's right. Mm -hmm. Well, John, is there anything else I need to get out before I let you out of here? I got to get a break.